A new spin-off of 911 is in development, even as 911 Lone Star approaches its end. Franchise co-creator Ryan Murphy recently detailed why the franchise's first spin-off, 911 Lone Star Season 5, will be the last despite being a ratings hit. Murphy noted that, following the merger between Fox and Disney, the financials of Lone Star were no longer viable. This lines up with previous reporting about how Fox was no longer willing to pay 20th Television which is owned by Disney, a relatively large license fee in order to air the series. 911 is poised to grow, nonetheless, with another spin-off. Murphy, who created the franchise with Brad Falchuk and Tim Minear, told Variety that he and Minear are working to create a new spin-off that could debut as early as the next fall season. While touching on the reasons behind the 911 Lone Star cancellation, Murphy also shares that the spin-off will take place in a new city. Read the full quote below. What a 911 spin off could mean for the franchise. Familiar characters may not go too far. With the ending of 911, Lone Star looming and the fact that 911 is a long running show with an established cast, it's possible that both shows will not continue for much longer. 911 Season 9 is not confirmed, although it is proper since the series would likely want the space to deliver a proper ending. But if it's the case that the main series will bow out soon, a spin-off could mean that popular characters could reprise their roles in guest appearances. If the spin-off is successful, it could mean there's an incentive to create more spin-offs and more character-based offshoots. It is a little premature to speculate too wildly, however, key details like casting and location are still unknown at this early stage. Our take on a 911 spin-off. The franchise has a unique fandom. Owen standing by the fire truck in 911, Lone Star Season 5, Episode 1. For a procedural, 911 has successfully built up a devoted fandom that is arguably more tuned in and active in discussing their love for the franchise when compared to other procedurals. That is a testament to the relationships that the audience has built with the characters and, in many cases, the fondness that the cast has accumulated. That won't be easy to replicate. But given Murphy's involvement, and the fact that he currently has six shows airing on different platforms, with more on the way, he might have cracked the secret to what makes a show catch on.